What is up, everybody? I'll tell you what it is about that time. And this is episode 21 of Sunny and the Show. And I'll tell you what, with an ace and a jack of spades, it's your boy, Sunny. I'll tell you what, we hit black jack and it equals up to. 21 if anybody knows how to play that game it's kind of a fun thing to do but what's been going on y'all um, let's see what it, it's pretty nice it's time to let down our hair i'm feeling a little bit um bushy rough stumble probably gonna cut this episode short uh, i'm kind of like i kind of felt a few raindrops far earlier and i i'm feeling like um you know i'm feeling Kind of hey, the weather. I don't know why I woke up a little bit earlier than I normally would this morning, but um, it seems kind of weird. I absolutely had one of my favorite, favorite things to eat in the whole world. You know, that big orange W just gives me comfort to let me know that I am kind of halfway, almost a decent kind of person. It, um, it reconfirms. The simple idea that um, everything is going to be all right, but um, I tell you, I'm ready to get. I'm, I'm ready to get back on the road. I'm ready to go. Get going. Get uh, get running. Get uh, get moving. This whole thing. I could have thought possibly that it was a lot bigger than it actually is, but um, maybe I need to draw back the curtains a little bit, and you know. Find my way through all this stuff. But uh, here I sit, coming up on 1:30 in the morning. Uh, that's kind of kind of a good thing. And I stepped inside the um, the old home away from home to get a few uh, paper towels and and uh, good stuff. Had some things to clean up. Well, it turns out I'm in a mess of the of the messiness. Hmm. But um, if you make a mess of the messiness, does that make it a clean thing? I don't know. But um, is, this is kind of cool. Uh, I would love to say the milestones and everything's great as far as the, um, you know, whatever's concerned. The, um, well, that was a nice thing I just did. You know, maybe it's, um, maybe it's a 21, maybe it's 23, maybe it's 84, I don't know. But I tell you what, every single one of these that I do is somewhat special in my mind. Just because I get 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 out there and get uh, get doing something. And um, I tell you what, I I couldn't I couldn't trade uh, much of my life, much of anything about me for the uh, for anything in the world. Um, I kind of I kind of get to the point where I like. I like what I'm doing. Um, I like how I've become, um, and that's uh, that's kind of the whole point of the whole deal. Is the fact that if you don't like something, you change it. You know, you're if you're 114 years old, you're um, it's never too late to get down and get a little bit of the good old um, you know, just change one little thing uh, about yourself that you don't like. Uh, eventually, when you realize there's nothing to change, um, you know, change something that's better uh, for the best, and that's and that's kind of the point. Bad, good, better, best. That's that's how you that's how you become somebody that you enjoy hanging out, hanging around. Um, you know, there's there comes a point for all of us when we're uh, just wanting something, anything. Just um, but I tell you, I tell you what, people, you're you're stuck in there. You're stuck in that um, in that cage made of skin. So you might as well enjoy yourself. You might as well enjoy who you are. And uh, I think the whole point to getting um, to getting part of the way there is to go ahead and um, you know become. Uh, just so to become who you want. Um, 
if you don't like the person that you are, you, just, you know, tomorrow's a brand new day. Start on a new path. And uh, the neat thing for me was looking at the the road that came up ahead was it was easy. It was an easy choice for me because I saw I looked to my left and I saw an infinite number of paths. And I looked back to my right and I saw an infinite number of more paths. So, um, whenever I feel like it, whenever I want to, I think, and maybe I'm incorrect about this, but maybe I think that it's easy for me to just jump on the next road. Uh, it's time, you know, maybe it's time to get going. Maybe it's time, um, you know, if you don't like that one, jump back, uh, jump back here or jump back to the next one after that. Maybe the whole point is uh, don't ever sit still. Don't ever quit. Uh, <laughs> goodness gracious, I'm sorry about this, people. I'm just readjusting my left desk. The point of the whole thing is don't ever sit still. Don't ever give up. Uh, don't ever quit trying to change for the better. And sometimes changing for the better means that you're going to end up on a road that you don't like. But um, there's no problem with getting out and you know, getting on with the next step. Sometimes it's like it feels like you're getting out of a moving car. And uh but uh, you know once you're once you're out you're out. So that's that's kind of a good thing. I'm I'm sorry about my eyes right now, people. I'm having that weird kind of allergies to where I'm kinda of like the the light's kind of right in my face. And I'm kind of not, I don't know what to feel about this, uh, this left eye thing that I got going here. Seems like my left eye is all squinty and my right eye is like, Oh, I'm wide awake, we're, we're going to go. But, um, I, uh, we're doing our first live tomorrow night. I, I am, uh, somewhat nervous about it. Um, I'm nervous that no one's going to show up. I'm nervous that nothing's going to happen. I'm nervous about a lot of things. Um, I'm nervous. Uh, I've got to get some things cleaned up and straightened up and, you know, do the whole thing and uh, get the office straightened out. And, you know, get, get everything going the way everything needs to be going. But um, I tell you what, um, that that means that I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to get running. Uh, get gunned. And um, I was watching the... Uh, Robert over last night, and he was so funny because he kept saying, "Stay strong and stay pretty well." It's not exactly my advice, but uh, you know, my advice is fully uh, beehive, and you know exactly what it is to beehive. So um, uh, I'm gonna close this down. I'm just gonna say, "Be good," because I'm out.